starting from P20 since I missed the qualifying session. Had a decent start, and I can easily pass the green car. Then I remembered, it's a low ELO race. Better to wait for them to crash into each other. Sure enough, it happened quickly, with four cars taken out in front of me. I could have taken T1 easily, but I decided to hold back a bit. Got a better exit out of T1 and passed car number 17. Track got a little bit clear and I was able to push, not being afraid of one player to catch dust and hit me. I tried to move like Albon in Canada, but then realized I was driving more like Mazepin on drugs, so I chilled out. In the next corner, without much emotion, I had good grip and passed another car, avoiding the apex like it was nothing. Feeling alone on the track, I started singing Bye Bye from Deadpool in my head, waiting for the OnlyFans car to challenge me. Late on the brakes, and the OnlyFans car, looking like a cheap soap, passed me. Distracted, trying to figure out the username of the OnlyFans account to check out after the race. I missed the next corner and fell behind him. Like, subscribe, share so Max Verstappen can find me. Looking forward to catch him like Latifi, who was chasing one point in F1, I managed to lose him but at least I didn't hit the wall in Abu Dhabi 2021 to create the biggest controversy of all time. So big win for me. He started pulling away, but after three laps, I managed to break into the top 10. Progress. Bored with no action on track for a few laps, I suddenly spotted a blue Ferrari driven by Vettel, leaving Verstappen and Raikkonen out of the race. I happily took advantage and gained more positions. A few laps later, young Verstappen got a better exit on the last turn, giving me some action in the final five minutes of the race. However, young Verstappen, overwhelmed by the pressure from Horner, missed the corner, and I said, as I passed him. Then, the blue Fettel soap car was chasing me again, making me uncomfortable after seeing what he did to others. He missed the final turn, though and I moved into fifth place. The last lap was crazy, full of emotions, as I was chased by a very aggressive Raikkonen. He passed me after a slight contact, but I held back to avoid a DNF at the very end. In the final corner, angry Raikkonen missed it and decided it would be smart to hit me hoping I'd lose the race too. Karma got him though. 